Okay, so I tried to learn Welsh a little bit ago, and I've now just found um, a podcast which will help people to learn Welsh. Um, and um, I'm going to be doing a little bit of a class, and the Welsh can all take the mickey in a minute and say I'm pronouncing stuff wrong because I am from Leeds in England and have only been to Wales once when I went to Oswestry. And... Um, so here we go with me trying to follow this gentleman and learn Welsh. I'm going to leave a couple of seconds for you to pronounce it after me. I'll usually say the word twice, each time leaving a gap of a couple of seconds so that you can pronounce the word. Now sometimes I'll also spell the word for you so you can see how the spelling relates to the way you say or pronounce the word. Because the spelling in Welsh is very different to the spelling in English. Okay, so let's start. We're going to start by looking at the word hello. Hello in Welsh is shumai. 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 That's in South Wales. Now in North Wales, you'll hear sitmai. 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 Now you can say either depending which part of the country that you're in at the time. So let's say that again. Shumai. 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 Sitmai. 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 Now, you'll also hear people say colloquially, using an anglicised form of Welsh, Hello. Hello. Which is just hello, spelt with one L. But the proper way of saying the word is shumai. 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 Good. Now... You'll also, for goodbye, you'll hear a few different expressions. Now, one way of saying goodbye is hoil. 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 That means goodbye. But if you want to say a bigger goodbye, a more expressive goodbye, you could say hoil vaur. Hoil vaur. Hoil vaur. Hoil vaur. Remember to roll those R's at the end of that word, vaur. That's important. That's something you'll have to get used to as well. Now, hoil means goodbye, but vaur means big. So it's literally a big goodbye. We'll try that again. Hoil. Hoil. And hoil vaur. Hoil vaur. Hoil vaur. Now, another way of saying goodbye, especially in South Wales and in areas like Llanelli and Carmarthen, would be Dabuchi. 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 Can you hear that (laughs) sound? It's a C-H-I. He. Sounds a bit like key with a (laughs) at the beginning of the word. So C-H is a (laughs) sound and R is a R sound. Okay, so remember those as we go on along. So, dabohi. 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 Which often gets shortened to dabo. 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 Goodbye. So, those are ways of saying hello and goodbye. <laughs>